The Union Aerospace Corporation is the largest corporate entity in existence. Originally focused on weapon and defense contracts, new ventures have expanded into biological research, space exploration, and other scientific endeavors. With unlimited funds and the ability to engage in research outside of moral and legal obligations, the UAC controls the most advanced technology ever conceived. Incoming transport detected. Mars approach, Dark Star with U07063 passing through 38000. Roger, Dark Star, descend to 2000, set speed, contact ground on 26972. Roger that tower. Have them on radar, sir. They'll be landing in a few moments. Excellent. See that Counselor Swan is sent directly to me. Yes, sir. Tower, Dark Star on final. We've got you, Dark Star. You are set for lockdown. Welcome back. Welcome to Mars City, Union Aerospace's premier I've research facility. To expedite your processing, please proceed directly to reception. Welcome to Mars, Marine. I'm gonna need you to step on one of those red squares on the floor for a bioscan. This'll only take a second. Okay, let me get this started. You're gonna need to hold still. Moving around only makes the test take longer. Alright, bioscan looks good. You're cleared for entry. On behalf of the UAC, welcome to Mars City. This facility serves as the central hub for all scientific research. Welcome to Mars. Earth time? You can just leave your bag there. I'll have it sent up your quarters. Okay, there's a few things we need to take care of first. This is your personal data assistant. You'll need this to access all secure areas. If you get clearance for any security zones, it'll download directly. It's important, so don't lose it. I see here that Sergeant Kelly has requested your immediate attention. Head directly to Marine Command. It's just that way. Follow the signs. Mars City is a smoke-free facility. Please smoke only in designated before. areas. You must be with that new Thank you for your cooperation. I'm here because there seems to be some very serious problems. Oh, really? Do I need to remind you of the groundbreaking work that we're doing here? No, but I've been authorized by the board to look at everything. The board authorized you? Hmm. The board doesn't know the first thing about science. All they want is something to make them more money, some product. Don't worry, they'll get their product. After how many accidents? Tell me, Dr. Petruger, why are so many workers spooked complaining requesting transfers off Mars? They simply can't handle life here. They're exhausted and overworked. If I had a larger, more competent staff and bigger budget, 
even these few accidents could have been avoided. I'm afraid you'll get nothing more until my report is filed with the board. I will need full access, Dr. Petruga, Delta included. I won't have any difficulties doing that, will I? Only if you get lost, Swan. Just stay out of my way. Amazing things will happen here soon. You just wait. Let's go. I don't think I've seen you before. You must be a replacement for one of the guys we lost. Yeah, so those suits arrived too. Weird. The UAC must be working on Accidents. Attention. Dr. Braddock, please report to Environment Management Office. We report to Sergeant Alpha. Kelly ASAP. He's in Command HQ. Delta Science Management. We would like to request another security team here in Delta. Took your sweet time, Marine? Now, here's the situation. Another member of the science team's gone missing. Since you're the ranking FNG, you get to find him. I want you to check out the old decommissioned comm facility. We heard he might be heading that way. The only way there is through the service passage under Mars City. I've programmed this sentry to guide you to the maintenance elevator. You follow the sentry better than you've followed orders so far. You pick up some gear at the security checkpoint at the bottom of the elevator. Oh, and when you find him, just bring him back. Do not hurt him. Now move out. Attention UAC personnel. Interested in earning more credits? Volunteer at Delta Labs today. See your service branch director for more details. You know what Carter said? No, what? He said that. The UAC cares about the quality of life of its employees. Please, take advantage of our quality medical care services. Welcome to the dungeon, Marine. Most unexciting place on Mars. I'm gonna need you to grab some armor and secure your pistol before I can pass you through security. Okay, grab your gear. Now you're ready for combat. Let me do a radio test. Mars Sec radio check. Excellent. Good signal. Looks like you've been assigned the decommissioned comm facility. Just follow the main passage through the underground junction and straight out. We'll have a quick evac. And what better way to see the Martian surface than to run across it? Okay, you're all set. Oh yeah, keep in mind, civilians are working down here. Don't get excited and shoot it. Hey, don't touch that. Hey! You're looking for the scientist, right? I'm not sure you want to find him. You see... Uh, uh, never mind. Don't listen to me. Never mind what I said. Listen, Scotty. I've done this a million times. It's not that hard. Why don't you crawl your fat ass down here and do it yourself? Because I'm getting paid to make sure you do it. Just finish the coupling, buddy. 
Don't know if I can really help you with anything. Kind of busy here. This is Grant Baston, your environmental services supervisor. The date is October 19th. I've been hearing an alarming number of reports on some, uh, you unexplainable that, things. Being on another on planet and working just underground has always been a little spooky. Enough, so we always have the occasional report of strange things. But what is worrying me is the fact that the number of these reports are up by a lot. People are truly frightened. The rumors we're hearing about experiments from the Delta Complex are not helping. The power fluctuations aren't helping at all either. Having the lights flicker constantly and losing power for several minutes at a time is scaring everyone down here. I'm doing my best to keep people in track, but we're continually shorthanded. Someone's reporting in sick almost every day. I'll keep my director apprised of the situation, and we'll continue to log reports as I get them. Hey, you're that new guy headed for the old comm center, right? You'd better hustle up, pal. This passage doesn't go all the way there. You'll have a quick walk outside to the center's airlock. Eh, hey, don't sweat it. Your suit's got plenty of oxygen. This is Sergeant Kelly. You need to double time it down there. Search your assigned area and haul your ass back to Mars City. Out. You must let me get this communication out. They have to be warned while there is still time. I can't let... I, you don't know what I've seen. You can't possibly understand or comprehend. The devil is real. I know. I built his cage. I'm getting abnormal readings here. This is bad. God! I all these levels. Sergeant Kelly, we're under attack by an unknown enemy force. Fall back to Marine HQ to regroup. I say again, fall back to Marine HQ and await further orders. Give sit rest. Over. Command HQ, this is Bravo Team. We've got one Marine down, two wounded. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 4. We are pinned down now. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 2. Main power systems down at sun level. Backup and life support systems only. we got lots of civilian casualties. It's a mess. Command HQ, attempting to secure the area.
further orders. This is the audio log of Frank Delahue, engineering manager assigned to power production dated October 18, 2145. The current operational status of the grid is 23% over nominal capacity. I've increased work shifts to 12 hours a day for all percent of the people. The constant and increasing load from the Delta complex is causing havoc. We are going to start losing critical systems if we have to sustain these levels much longer. I request clearance to requisition parts from other departments in order to maintain the system. Okay, I don't know what is going on with Delta, but I'm doing all I can to make The constant demands are bad enough, but the rumors of the line are making things a whole lot worse. I gotta tell you, things don't get better soon. All hell is gonna break loose.